So, let's skip a little bit ahead, and um, I'll probably be seeing you guys in the next sort of segment of action, which is going to be the Spanish Civil War, which happens in uh, the summer of 1936. And you can also see the date up here. Right now it's February 25th, 1936. Anyway, I'll see you guys then. So, we're back again. Um, Nationalist uh, Spain has declared war on Republican Spain, and on a side note, I've never ever seen this before. Every I, I'm not sure about the historical context about this, but uh, every time this uh, subnation of China, there's a bunch of different nations of China um, all over the place, but this one is called uh, the 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 Ganix clique clique. I'm not sure how to pronounce that. Whatever, but anyway, they always declare war on nationalist China for some reason. But usually nationalist China hands them their ass. But this time, these guys are kicking ass. Which is something I've never seen before. Anyway, uh, we'll, we'll keep an eye on how that you know development continues. Right now, let's look at uh, Spain. And... Basically, uh, you know, the, the Civil War happens, and almost always, Nationalist Spain wins. I have seen a couple of times where Republican Spain wins, and uh, usually I'm on the side that, I, that wants Republican Spain to win, but, you know, Nationalist Spain is fascist, and, you know, us fascist bros have to stick together, so, you know, I'll support them. I might send them, if I see that they're losing, I might send them an infantry division or two, uh, help them that right now we can't see what's going on um, it's just the early phases of the war however national Spain took Madrid very quickly which um, does bode well for the fascists but it looks like the Republicans are fighting back very quickly so what I think I'm gonna do is uh, sometimes I actually decline the deals I might actually send them couple units of infantry. Also, it looks like uh, the Nationalist Chinese are fighting back and are kicking the crap out of the, the Ganix clique. The, the Ganic, uh, whatever. I don't, I'm not even going to try anymore to pronounce that, but let's see if I can send them any, any divisions. An openness. I'm going to go to my uh, Hoshindan and ask them if they Send them three divisions. There we go. And you can send them three divisions of uh, Japanese troops, and they can see for themselves how uh, our Japanese boys fight. <coughs> Excuse me. Also been producing. Troops back on the home front, and I'm continually transporting them over to the Chinese mainland. So we'll keep a close eye and uh, see what's going to happen for now. Right now, it looks like some fascists are surrounded here. Oh, there they go. That's not good. That's not good. Yeah. Things are not looking good for uh, fascist Spain right now. Still no movement on the front. Not a lot going on by now. We'll, we'll see how things go. What the hell? That's weird. What the hell is going on? Everything's gone topsy-turvy. Suddenly, um, National Spain is annexing this random place. Looks like Communist China took a couple uh, provinces from the Nationalists. Took actually a lot of territory from the Nationalists. In our, in our, man, this is going to be really easy to kick the shit out of Nationalist China right now. If they're losing to crappy nations like the, Gan the Ganix clique and um, communist China but um, things are not looking good for uh, for nationalist Spain this is very unfortunate I'm not gonna waste any more uh, 
any more divisions on them, but it looks like they've lost this war. And unfortunately, I wasted a couple divisions uh, sending them there. But already, this is a weird history. As you can see, like, uh, Communist China is just a rising superpower right now. Or is it <laughs> in the Chinese realm? Nationalist China is getting picked apart by smaller, weaker nations. And, um, fortunately, it looks like this is going to set the stage for a very easy and quick defeat of, uh, the Chinese and also, um, Annex, you know, all, the, all these other guys, because now China's divided and weak. Usually what happens is all these smaller, um, nations, all these smaller sections of the Chinese join together with nationalist China to fight the Japanese, but you know, right now it, it looks like that might not happen. Yep, looks like it's all over for fascist, uh, fascist Spain. But, oh shit. The long, uh, scheme of things, I don't think it's gonna matter, because it didn't matter a whole lot that, uh, fascist Spain won the Civil War, historically. I mean, it probably mattered a whole lot to the Spanish people themselves, but, you know, worldwide, you know, it was, it was not a lot of impact. It's kind of a testing ground for, uh, new weapons and doctrines that would be, um, shown off in World War II, and yeah. <laughs> Just Spain is down to two provinces. I'm just really interested in what's uh, what's going on uh, in the Chinese domain. Like, look at this. Ch Communist China is just tearing up um, the nationalists right now. <laughs> 